hi Sagittarius welcome to this reading and this is your mid April reading and I will pull in cards to check in what is your recent past current immediate future and what are uh, what are your focuses on as well as uh, what to release in what you are embracing and also I will uh, pull in a few oracle messages as um, a message uh, a message blessings a message of blessings as and these are all general readings so please take only that resonates with you and you can always leave the rest behind and if you any of you are new to my channel then you can uh, consider hitting uh, the subscribe button along with the bell icon so that you get uh, notifications for all the uh, videos that i upload on a regular basis so let's see what energies are coming towards uh, sagittarius what are your uh, current energies what are your recent past energies current energies and as well as your immediate future so in your current uh, recent past it's it is the emperor three of pentacles the nine of swords uh, in your current, it is Six of Pentacles, Judgment, the Star, and in your immediate future is Two of Cups, Queen of Wands, and Six of Swords, and your overall is the Queen of Swords. Uh, so it is like the overall is the Queen of Swords, where it it is like you are. Um, looking for you are seeking the clarity or you already have the clarity and you are just focused and with your um with your very um confident uh, energies you are just looking ahead and you know what it is is happening or it's what is going to happen so it is like you have the clarity and you have the wisdom and intelligent uh, intelligence and in analyzing things and you just know what it is happening so this is what in your overall energies is uh, and you have a very direct uh, communications like you are very well communicating uh, uh, in your surroundings and you are receiving as well as you are giving communications in a very in a very straightforward and in a very direct way with your with your intelligent and with your logic uh, and uh, wisdom so this is your overall energy and in your recent past you had the emperor uh, the three of pentacles and the nine of swords uh, uh, which is like uh, you were you were into the energy of uh, like in control where you had uh, collaborations with others and you just know what you have to uh, do so with your emperor kind of energy you had the confident and you have everything in your power to collaborate and communicate with uh, people and uh, to see how things are going on and also you had uh, like some kind of over anxiety as well because uh, because of your controlling energy made you into this process of where you are uh, were anxious and you were overthinking into certain things that which was not actually happened you were just like um, it was your uh, thoughts and anxiety and worries that made you over overthink because of your controlling uh, way of uh, handling situations and which uh, with others and uh, that made you more like uh, uh, more like um, uh, to think uh, very to think in a very not in a different way like you you were just overthinking so you had that uh, energies of um, overthinking and uh, in your recent that which has brought into in your current energies like in your uh, current energies which you have is the six of pentacles which is like a give and take kind of uh, energies where you are just seeing like how much you can give uh, it is like giving or uh, giving material positions as well like contribution or having giving charity but at the same time you are seeing how much can you give your energies to others like how much can you 
you uh, put in your efforts your energies and you are just giving it to others so you are just balancing your energies as well like how you can uh, bring a balance into your give and give and receive kind of energies and you have some uh, wake up call as well where you are getting a second chance of doing things so uh like judgment where you are also judging yourself like uh what is it like are you doing the right things on and also like you are receiving support as well at the same time but you have been but you are going through a second chance where you want to see uh, how you can um benefit uh, with uh things so and you are receiving support as well and um it is like a kind of you are are thanking as well like in, in the present situations where which is uh, you are also becoming like uh, some kind of illumination is also taking place where there is a hope for the future hope um, there is a hope for a better tomorrow and you are like in a kind of a star kind of a uh, energy where uh, you are being portrayed as uh, someone who is who can manage well and who can bring hope for the future so this is in your current situation and in your future which is leading is like two of uh, cups where you are getting in long into a kind of uh, partnerships a long-term partnerships where you are where the uh, understanding of give and receive will be at the same level and uh, you will see like how uh, you can make that those relationships in a very uh, which will have longevity as well as uh, some parallel uh, give and take kind of situations like um, you like you are up leveling uh, with to, uh, together like mutual understanding mutual respect so that is or a mutual kind of energies uh, even within yourself queen of wands is like a very nurturing kind of energies um, uh, feminine energy where you are creative passionate and um, uh, hope like abundance and hope as well as with your protective nature you are uh, moving ahead like you are uh, taking care of your uh, energies how much you are giving it outside as as it is in your current energy uh, but at the same time you are also protecting your energies like creating a boundary as well with your creativity enthusiasm uh, compassionate uh, loving kind of nature with your strength and vitality at the same time you are protecting your energy as well you can see this cat uh, over here which is like a kind of protection is uh, shown up and six of uh, souls like you are not paying attention to anything which is um, not helping you so you are moving ahead you are getting some support and with that support you are just moving ahead you are not knowing what is coming uh sorry what is coming on your way but at the same time you just uh, know that uh there are there are support and it, it is taking you along so because you have a judgment card over here where this angel is uh blowing um helping or giving uh giving a sound support uh to uh to these people like so you are also just getting moving ahead uh from or not looking back but moving forward how you can have uh how you can see the result that you are willing to see it so this is what it is showing up in your uh immediate future and so let's see what you what you will be mostly focusing on since you have the clarity in of everything and how you would like to go so what you will be mostly focusing on yes your focus will be on the victory as well as um, like support uh, like you will try your best to receive support from others as well as uh, the victory over here the recognitions the um, uh, everything like um, you rewards recognitions that which you have already uh, done or created now you are focusing on and uh, that what you what is that one thing what you need to release at the same time because you are taking up so many things over here it is like full of uh, fire energy water energy earth and air energy all the energies are over here and since you have the queen of souls which is like the air communications and your uh, 
uh, your mind process your thought process so what you need to release at this time okay there will be very fast forward things will be there so maybe your communications you just need to be aware like how you are communicating so in certain areas you just need to level up with your um, with the speed so maybe in certain to level up with the speed you may need to um, release certain areas where it is not required that is why you have the six of swords as well which is like that which doesn't serve you just you are moving ahead so you are releasing those that doesn't letting go of things that which doesn't serve you uh, into your process where you would like to see the outcome and what are you embracing at this time at this time what are you embracing at this time okay the lovers which is like um your remain emotions you are embracing your emotions very well your feelings well like you will be communicating very well like straightforward your communications will be very straightforward so it is like you are embracing your feelings like your expressions that you would like to express and um, uh, you will just uh, see that whether whatever is happening um, you will just embrace it with your knowledge wisdom uh, with your intelligence uh, with your courage compassion love so you are you will be embracing your feelings and out of that feelings you will be taking care of things that is coming on the way so this is what i have for you uh, sagittarius let's see what um, uh, angel message we receive for you as a guidance okay the first one is leave your usual social circles behind seek out true companions exactly this is what it's already shown in this reading like to leave out certain areas which doesn't fit suit you well and just you move ahead and see what's better and the number nine over here which is like a number of completions or some kind of completion is going to happen or nine uh, hours nine days nine months or could be uh, somebody born on ninth the month nine september so within september something you can expect something to happen okay and the second message is live in the world as a dreamer create a future paradise yes like you will uh, think for what is happening like how you can do uh, your things well for the future so you will be mostly taking care like your thoughts process will be mostly on that and the third message is oh the number over here is the eight eight which is a um, number of movement could be eight hours eight months eight days or somebody born on august and the tree of wishes is calling your name and almost forgetting wish will now come true so you might have um, wished for anything that which you have forgotten for a long time because of your busy schedule or because of other activities you were just you forgot though uh, you have forgotten that wish that wish is coming now it's going to uh, come into fruition so expect something uh, miracles to happen or something will happen it in a very sudden way that will surprise you and uh, the number over here is the 24 um, could be 24 hours 24 days or uh, or a 24 date in whichever month or 4 plus 6 uh, 4 plus 2 is 6 maybe uh, June 24th like that so whichever works well in your situation so i have the one last card i'm going to pull out from the soul flower plant spirit oracle deck to see what you need to know and this will be a message for you and i will conclude with this message okay it is rose and it talks about joy this is rose talks about joy so let's see what it says rose is comforting and soothing infusing your heart and soul with gratitude and joy and helping you to stay centered and loving towards yourself and others when it is needed most rose reminds you to be open to the sweetness of life and supports your personal uh, growth whatever the conditions surrounding you may be so whatever whichever conditions you are in you will be filled with joy and this is what uh, rose is talking about so i hope this helped sagittarius that's all i have for you and um thank you for tuning in and see you 
next time bye